Okay, guys, welcome back to a another video of World Zero. Thank you guys for the support. Thank you guys for the love. Um, we are here at the Pet Master. So, um, if you guys know, I'm gonna go briefly fast on how to do the pet stuff. A lot of you guys already know how to do it, so this is not for you guys. This is for the people that don't know how to do it. So if you, if you know how to do all of the things, the twists and stuff like that, that's good for you. Wow. But if it's if for the people that don't know, like this is for you guys. But if you don't know, like how to like um how to do the pet system thing all right first things first if you do a quest like if you do a quest in like one of the open worlds uh let's say worlds one um you will get a i think you will get a first pet if you if i'm if i'm clear you will get a first pet especially in world one or two yeah here we go so if you if you go into the world to play the game it's gonna say protect the warm dungeon and you will receive uh, the first mission, a starter, a star egg. So if you get this star egg, it's going to look like this. Do I have one egg here? Yeah. So it's going to look like this. So your egg is going to be like a real egg with stars. Like, like that. You see? You can see it right perfectly. So it's going to be like this. Now you're going to think as a starter level, you're going to be like, oh, what do I do now? So what you do is in the open world, if you do quests and stuff like that, it's going to be dropping strawberries uh duck uh the donuts and uh sunday and cake slices how do you obtain those um pretty easy um right of the bay i love to show people how to get those stuff so basically it doesn't matter what mob or who else do you kill or destroy you just go you just go walk up to a mount it will drop some money and it will drop that so that is the sunday right there the sunday is one of the highest one in the game so the Sunday will give you uh, five times XP. Uh, the donut will give you two times XP. The strawberry gives you one, and the cake will give you three. So you you already know like the the Sunday you need to have right now. You already know that as a player. I know you're new, but now you know. All right, I need to get a lot of Sundays, right? You you, you understand that. So what do you do then? You click on the egg. It says feed egg. If you feed the egg, now comes an option. That is gonna say, what do you wanna use? So let's just say you grind, you played a lot of the game and you done a couple of dungeons and you started getting some items. This one right here, what you see the candy, this is from the battle pass. I can show you right here, the battle pass pet candy. That means you can level up an instant level. So don't look at that. You're gonna look at these ones. Uh, let's just stand safe, safe here because these pets are gonna keep fighting me. So, I love to stand on this stair. I don't know why. Um, I don't know why, because the stairs look so nice. Here, I love to stand here. So, my egg is coming, right? So, I will start, like, the level once you can do. So, like, there is, like, an XP bar here, how far it goes. So, the level, when it's going to level. So, when you reach this, it's going to level to that. So, in my opinion, I just wanted to do it fast. So, we're going to use the strawberry. Uh, the Sunday. So the Sunday, 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 Sunday. And now it's level 50. And it's going to say right now, hatch egg. Which we're going to do. We're going to hatch the egg. And we hatched it. So I don't know what we're going to get. What are we, what are we getting? We are getting a... All right. <laughs> we are getting a, a owl. Um, we're going to call it YouTube content. That's how I call my all of my um, birds or pets. YouTube content. So YouTube content. It's right here. So the next one is going to be, if you go back inventory and back to the pet at feed again, it's going to say 11 XP. So the next level is going to be level uh, 10 to 20. So you're going to keep doing that till, you know, till you reach that level, basically. So it's, it lags a little. So I know because it goes fast, 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 fast. So as soon as you hit like level 20, um, it's going to level up again. So oh, it doesn't really uh, max level as you guys can see here at max level and it's going to level up again. Boom. to so something different. All right. Now you think legend, how do you know this? Right. So we're going to go back and let's see. Yeah, we're going to go back into the pet master right here, which you have like a like a Pokedex. You can see it like Pokemon. So you have a pet Dex so you can see what which pet does what or if you get this pet what it does 
So you, if you see your pet, just go in here and think like, hey, where's my pet? Where does it go? So right now you can see I have the pet owl, right? This pet owl right here. We started out with this one and it went, it, it, it gone to this one and it went to this one. And that's going to be the purple one, ice spike. And then it can be either one pet that heals me with unknown perks or the other pet that does potion slash with unknown perks. That's basically it. So as you guys can see, we are here with the owl that spit fireball and we can introduce the fireball. Like is the fireball AOE? Yes, it is. It is a good AOE. I'm not going to lie. It is pretty good. It's like the mage fireball. So um, let's see if we can group up some, um, some bear wolves. That's the best introduction here. So we just, um, we, ha we introduced some bear wolves right here. Let's see here. All right. Press the C and we're going to use one and it has like an AOE. See that? Not bad, isn't it? Not bad. For your pet, you're doing nothing. <laughs> AOE, boom. It's like, a, it's like a ball. So keep in mind, if you want your pet to be, stay like that, you want that ability, leave it like that. But you can level up, level it up some more. All right. Now we are on the stage that it is going to purple. Purple is basically your class that is not always good. But due to the fact that the last one is the best, so you want to keep leveling. So you're going to use whatever you have in your power to get to level 30. So this is going to hurt me. Like, I don't have a lot of items anymore because I haven't been... Wait, that's the two. Because I haven't been leveling at all. I've been doing uh, with you guys some episodes and not dungeon diving because the more you dungeon dive, the more you get... Uh, get from this so the more dungeons you do of course the more you get so maybe we can maybe we are gonna get we're gonna get to level 30 probably so so it's gonna take up take us a bunch of um of materials or you can say candies um but we're gonna try to to get it so we're gonna get to level xp level 20 that is right now and max level here we go max level and it's gonna evolve again so YouTube content evolves again into the purple one, which you can see here. And this is, again, you see that? If you remember that, is the ice spikes. Yeah, it's right there, ice spikes. That was the ability, bonus pet food chance, bonus walk speed. So according to this, we have bonus walk speed right now for 3%. So we are moving faster, 3%. All right, it's not bad. And then... After that, you level it to level 40, which I don't have enough for. But you get the, you, wait, maybe he's going to invite me for a couple of stuff. I don't know. Yeah. So, oh yeah, here. <laughs> he's just going to, he's just showing what it was. So if you level up, level it up to the max, it's going to be like this. So you're going to get this owl. This one is the purple one. This is the max Q level. So this one is the poison slash one. And you also have, I had also this one, the potion slash one, as you guys can see, or the other one that heals. It's basically that simple with the pet system in this game. But then again, um, there are some, some ones that are um, not easy obtainable or you need to grind hard for them. Um, but that's just preference on RNG. Keep that in mind. RNG is just a blessing in this game if you have it or not. This is basically how it is. You don't have control over RNG. So your friend can have the best in the game and you have the trash in the game. You have the best in the game. Your friend has the trash in the game. So it's just how it is. You got to be lucky. And if you're lucky, you're lucky. If you're bad, you're bad. All right. So, so that being said, uh, what is the pet that I'm rocking? I'm rocking the lion pet, which is my go-to pet right now. And yeah, that's basically it. Um, I also wanted to sh uh, show you guys that you also have a bank. Uh, since I am a member, you can say, or yeah, I'm a VIP member, I will have some more bank space. So if you have things, you can, if you didn't know, you can swap things over to another character. So let's just say you have a main character that has a golden pet. You can put it in your inventory like so, and it's, it's tra transferred here, and you make a level one, and that level one, can come to this bank and pick up that godly pet that can do everything. 
So, you know, you can do that. Um, so yeah, I did it right here. So this, this pet dragon here, um, this, this is the pet dragon right here, which you guys didn't see. It spits out a, a, uh, you want to see the, you want to see his, his thing. So this pet, pet dragon is pretty good for some AOE boss damage. Um, I'm just going to put it in the, oh. I just gotta put it in the open here and it's gonna he's gonna use the one. You see that? So a straight line, boom. Laser, 50 second cooldown. That's that. It's pretty cool. Right? So it's pretty strong, has a good DPS on it. So pretty strong. So keep in mind, have your pets on on the best build so you always be strong. Um so that being said, hope you guys enjoyed this quick little guide video about the pets. I don't think I missed something. I think let's just say, let's just see what, what what else did I miss before I go. So again, a recap, you can evolve pets right here or you can do it yourself or release pets right here. You can do it yourself or what you also can do, which I don't recommend, you can offline incubate the, the egg. So let's just say you put up an egg here and it's gonna until level one, you could say. You can do that. Just leave it right there. And it's going to do it for you. You don't have to put XP, whatever. You can just do it right here. You can also buy a couple of slots to put three here if you want to collect pets. That's what you can do. And act, you can go to the X shop. So what does that mean? So uh, you can get uh, this one, the pet, uh, the pet burrow, or you can do this one. You can just get pets that are just normally not or hard to get, you could say. You can buy them for two 2,000 gold or spend... Uh, you get full XP. You can also full XP it for 400 gems. And of course, you know how to get those gems is by um, you get this is by spending root box. So 200 root box is 500. Thousand is uh, 400 is thousand. 800 is 2000. Uh, four four thousand is 1600. So yeah. And with that, you can buy also a mount in the game like this mount. Or this mount, but I don't rec I don't highly recommend you not spending money on mount, but spending money on if you have the money, spend on cosmetics basically because cosmetics is what you want because you're already getting a free mount in this game, and it's free. This one is free. You only need one mount, and to believe me, believe me, it's, it's, it it doesn't add up to get a mount if you already get the mount, and the mount is the same mount like it's only a skin. It looks good. But it's, it's just a pre-skin. You're buying a skin, not the mount. Because the preset is this. This is the basic mount. And they put just skins on this mount. And that's why it looks different. That's it. All right? Keep that in mind. Don't spend your money on mounts. Spend your money on accessories like this, these things. Like this or this. Look cool. Like this. These type of things. Yes. But not on mounts. I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't do that. Like a clown mask or something. Like something stupid. Looks cool. Like crazy stuff. You see that? Looks cool. This, this, this. Yeah, I would do that, but not on mounts. You know, stupid stuff. <laughs> yeah. All right. So now you guys get the picture. Mounts bought at store are fast. Mounts bought in the store are faster. Doesn't matter if they're faster or not. I will get there with this mount. <laughs> It doesn't really matter if I'm faster or not. This is just good. It's good for me. And I already getting a mount due to the fact that I have the battle pass. And technically I also bought a mount, but all right. This mount right here is the wicked broomstick, which you can, I'm getting on level 38. I'm rank 12. So yeah, if I play a lot, I will get it. Arda Gaming, welcome in, man. Ambush. How long time, or oh, wait, long time no see, probably. <clears throat> All right. So again, thank you guys for this. Uh, sorry that this was a little, well, it was a little guide. Um, I hope you got this knowledge. Um, comment down below if I missed something. And if you want to get to know something, I'm squeezing everything to of this knowledge. And as always, thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next video. Peace.